Saudi Arabia just dropped billions on AI. Why? To protect their culture and control their internet's future. Welcome back to Joe's Not Worried About It, where we turn market anxiety into golden investment opportunities. I'm Joe, based right here in Austin, Texas, which is the new tech's wild west. Saudi Arabia just bought 18,000 of NVIDIA's most advanced AI chips, and they bought them for a brand new AI supercomputer. An AI supercomputer that's built from scratch in the desert. It's called Humane, and it's backed by the Saudi government's 700 billion public investment fund. But this isn't just a one-off order. Over the next five years, Saudi Arabia plans to scale this up to hundreds of thousands of NVIDIA super chips. By the time they're done, they'll have enough power to run national scale AI models and still have capacity left to simulate entire smart cities, energy grids, and logistics networks. This is infrastructure first AI. It comes before the apps, the startups, and most importantly, the hype. But why does this matter? Because a transaction this huge isn't about chips, it's about control. Saudi Arabia isn't renting compute from Amazon. They're building it on their own land, staffed by engineers they're training in-house with data that they own. They call it sovereign AI, and it's the backbone of their Vision 2030 plan. But why would countries go so far to build a sovereign AI? Because NVIDIA's CEO, Jensen Huang, has a warning for countries. If you don't build your own AI, your culture gets erased from the internet. And there's precedents for this. British English is actually almost entirely erased from the internet. And you're thinking, what's the big deal? Well, it means that their culture, their language, their dialect of English isn't on the internet anymore. Why? Because most software, most things involving tech and the internet happen in America. So we use America's English. And that's just one thing that's already happened. Think about what could happen to other countries. Without sovereign AI, your language, your dialects, your culture context, they vanish from the digital conversation. And that's a big deal. Saudi Arabia is not letting that happen. Oil built the last empire. Ships and AI will build the next one. And Wall Street's paying attention to this shift. Nvidia's stock jumped 5.6% after the deal. Analysts are already calling sovereign AI a 50 billion opportunity for chip makers. This is a bet on who controls AI infrastructure first as the rest of the world catches up. If you've got a podcast or a conference, hit me up. I'd love to dig deeper into why sovereign AI is the next oil and why Nvidia is selling the shovels. This thread is something we're going to pick up on more because if you don't own or control your cultural place on the internet, it's going to disappear. More on that later. If AI is a train, infrastructure is the tracks. So own the tracks and every train pays you.